I'd like to welcome everybody to the 2020 Berlin Elementary School 6th grade graduation. Hello Berlin Elementary 2020 graduates. I would like to welcome you and everyone watching to this very special first in a lifetime graduation ceremony. This has truly been a memorable year. We have watched you, our sixth grade graduates, not only grow as learners and young men and women this year, but over many years. You've worked very hard to get to this point. I want you to know that we are all very proud of you. Although each graduation is unique, this graduation is truly different. It's not what we usually do. We understand that it's not tradition. You might think, well, this isn't fair. Well, people in our history who have made a difference sometimes break tradition. They sometimes do something so remarkably different that they end up changing the world. Look at this as a way to say, you know, I was honored to be part of something different and so memorable. You can forever say you were a 2020 graduate of Berlin Elementary. We were unique. We were the ones who were able to be part of something that no one will ever forget. We're here today to honor you and your achievements. We're here to wish you well and to send you off with our best wishes as you leave Berlin and set sail to U32 or your next adventure. I want to encourage you to be yourself always. You are a strong class, at the same time individually talented and unique. Be yourself out there. Be the ones to make change. Be the ones to change the world. You hold the honor of being the Berlin class of 2020. And to me, that's pretty cool. You'll have a grand tale to tell your own kids and grandkids and great grandkids. At this time, I'd like to welcome our guest speaker, Mrs. Hilary Paquette. Mrs. Paquette has been teaching at Berlin for 15 years. She's been a teacher, interventionist, and will be heading to East Montpelier School as a special educator next year. Mrs. Paquette has not only been an amazing teacher, but has supported Berlin behind the scenes in so many ways. She's helped initiate and spearhead projects that have brought the Berlin community together. She's one of the nicest but strongest people you'll ever meet. We will miss her here at Berlin. Ladies and gentlemen, Mrs. Paquette. Hello, sixth grade graduates, family, and friends. I am excited to celebrate with you today on what is a very special day. While today might not be exactly what you imagined it would be, this is still your day. It's a special day for you, our sixth grade graduates, for your proud family members, and all the teachers and staff at Berlin Elementary School. Graduates, you should know that your families are very proud of you. They have high hopes for you. They believe in you, and you are making them proud by showing what you can do. This is perhaps more true now than ever before. In recent weeks, you've had to adapt and persevere, and you did it. Today would also be a good day to hug your family and thank them for supporting you because as much as this is your achievement, this is also the achievement of the people who care about you. They want you to be the best version of yourself and to live up to your potential. You've had some great times over the last several years and maybe some tough times too, but you did it and you succeeded. You're ready for that next step. I ask you to take this chance to dedicate yourself to making the next years even better. So I thought I would share a few pieces of advice to help you along the way. Have a positive attitude. Life is often what you make of it. Be honest and work hard. You're investing in yourself with every test you take and every book you read. Choose your actions and make your decisions carefully. You must live with the consequences of your choices. Be yourself and be confident in yourself. Remember, you don't have to follow the crowd. Do the right thing, even if no one is looking. Choose kindness always. Think before you speak. Consciously treat others the way you want to be treated. None of us is as smart as all of us. Find quality role models. Figure out what characteristics make him or her awesome 
and strive to adopt them into your own life. Live life with passion, set goals and work toward them. Laugh often. Don't be in too big a hurry to grow up. These are some great times in your life. Don't rush past them. And finally, be awesome, be amazing, be you. There are great things coming. And just as your parents are proud, each one of you should feel proud of yourself. So congratulations to all of the graduates, congratulations to the families, and finally, congratulations to the teachers, staff, and everyone else who helped our graduates get here today. I'll leave you with these final quotes from a great author with whom I imagine you are all familiar, Dr. Seuss. Will you succeed? Yes, you will indeed. 98 and three quarters percent guaranteed. You're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting. So get on your way. Congratulations again. As part of this graduation, we have put together something very special for everyone. Please enjoy. Congratulations, sixth grade class of 2020. I'll remember you fondly forever and always. You've been a wonderful class, showing incredible perseverance, hard work, and humor over the course of the year and the years that I've known you. Best of luck at U32 and in the years to come. Please keep in touch and visit when you can and enjoy your summer. Take care. Congratulations, sixth graders, class of 2020. We are all so very proud of you. You have worked really hard to get this far, and we are really excited to see where life takes you in your next journey at U32 or beyond. Um, it was a pleasure. I am so grateful for the time I had to work with you this year, and you're a really special group of kids, and I'm really excited to see what, what comes. Congratulations again. Berlin Elementary 2020 sixth grade graduates, I have so much to say to you. I am so proud of how much you've grown, how much you've grown with your learning, and how much you've grown up as kiddos. You worked really hard during um, this last dismissal period. I'm so proud of your perseverance. And I know you're going to do awesome things at U32. We will miss you. Congrats. Berlin sixth graders, 2020. So I have a little memory I'd like to share with you all. Uh, first of all, please excuse my lovely COVID hair. Um, but be something else to remember this year for. Um, so I remember back when you guys were in kindergarten, um, sometimes I would fill in for Mrs. Desro when she was in a meeting with Mr. Dodge. And that was quite the experience, I have to say. If you guys are, some of you remember kindergarten. Um, I remember the twins were in the class. Uh, Drew, Ethan Marshall, Timmy, I think, was in it, Aiden Vilbrun, pretty sure, Addison. It was crazy. <laughs> and then I think about you guys now and realize how much you've grown since when you were wild little Indians in kindergarten. So I know you'll continue to grow and do amazing things, just like you've grown so much during your time in Berlin Elementary School. Good luck and keep doing well. Bye. Hello, graduates. You can be anything you want to be when you go to U32. You could be groovy like Pete the Cat. You could be loyal like the Fly Guy. You could be brave like Katniss Everdeen. Or 
You could be spunky, hanky, panky, cranky, stinky, dinky, lanky, honky, tonky, winky, wonky, like the wonky donkey. Yeehaw! You'll be you. Congratulations. Congratulations. You've done it. You've graduated. You're on to bigger and better things. I'm going to miss you. You guys have been really fun. I can't believe you're graduating. I remember when you guys were just little kindergartners. Wow. Time just fly. So listen, if you can be only one thing in the world, the most important thing is to be kind. Always be kind. That's my little advice to you. Even if the person's not being nice, just be kind. It'll help you in the long run. It'll make it go a long way. Have a great day. Have a great summer. Don't forget about us here at Berlin. Hi, Hi sixth, sixth graders. graders. <laughs> we wanted to take this opportunity to wish you well as you transition to U32 next year. We'll all miss you at BES. Congratulations, sixth graders. I am very proud of your accomplishments. You will be missed. Please remember to come and visit as that is one of my favorite things as one of your teachers. I would like to read a short poem to you that is one of my favorites. It's called Keep On. Graduation is a successful ending and an exciting beginning. If you keep on learning, keep on dreaming, Keep on doing, you'll travel towards your goals until you get there. Keep up the good work, you can do it. From Mrs. Wagner. Hi, sixth graders. First, I just wanted to wish you the best of luck as you begin your new journey at U32. And second, I wanted to share a piece of advice from Walt Disney. Keep moving forward, opening new doors. Your curiosity will lead you down the path of success. Good luck to you. Hi graduates, this is Desro here. I can't believe how much time has gone by since you were in my class. I was fortunate enough to have you either as a kindergartner or again as a first grader. I have some very fond memories with you. When we were in kindergarten, we made owl puppets and studied birds of prey. Then we traveled to Vins. In first grade, we studied life cycles and learned about chicks and ducks, monarch butterflies, caterpillars. And we traveled to the Monshire Museum or we went to the Fairbanks Museum Either way, you did that in first or second grade. I hope that you do well in life, and I want you to think just like the monarch butterfly goes through many different changes, and or when it emerges from the chrysalis, it comes out and pumps its wings and they get stronger and stronger as they try harder. I want you to continue to grow and change and think like the monarch butterfly. So I wish you well, I will miss you, and I hope to see you around. Congratulations on graduating from sixth grade. As you spread your wings and take flight like the owls we studied in kindergarten, I want to remind you about the lessons you learned in kindergarten and hope that you can apply them in your new adventures beyond Berlin Elementary School. Here are just a few of the many things you learned in kindergarten. Share everything, play fair, don't hit people, put things back where you found them, clean up your own mess, don't take things that don't belong to you. Wash your hands, flush, take a nap every afternoon. Remember the little seed in the styrofoam cup? The roots go down and the plant goes up and nobody really knows how or why, but we are all like that. As you head off as a group to U32, I want you to remember that when you go out into the world, watch out for traffic, hold hands and stick together. Best of luck to all of you. Hello, Berlin sixth grade Fantasticos. 
You are at the end of this journey and getting ready for a new and exciting journey. Remember that you will go through change all through your life. And although sometimes it's scary and it feels like it's a bad thing, there is always a positive with every negative. So if you're feeling down or you're afraid or you're unsure, look around and search hard because there is a positive for every negative that you will find in your life. Sometimes you just have to look for it. So look hard, be happy, be successful, and I can't wait to see you in the future. I just wanted to say congratulations to all the sixth graders out there. I have fond memories of learning about turtles and the world and um, the great things that you did back when you were back in the primary wing. And I wish you the best at U32 and I hope to see you there. And I have a picture that I wanted to share. So from Rusty and Mrs. Turcott, Back at Berlin Elementary School, I wish the cl this class of 2020 the best of luck going to U32. Cheers. Hey, 2020 Bobcats. Well, you've made it. Congratulations. I hope that you have a great summer. Good luck. And I'm going to miss all of you. My favorite memory from Berlin Elementary was when the Berlin Fire Department came by and shot soapy foam into the air that we could all play in. My favorite memory from Berlin Elementary School was doing a 5th and 6th grade art and music collaboration. It was nice seeing some of my friends' art and my art being presented in a church in Montpelier. So I bet you're all wondering like, how I kind of got into comics. Well, here's your answer. So I started, or so I kind of, I've always kind of been into just reading comics, but I think in, it was in third grade, that's when I really, or that's when I really hit off. And it, so we were doing spelling at the time, and we were just, and she told us, Miss Seussman told us to, or it was one of the spelling options to make a comic out of with that had all the spelling words, and it, I loved it. And then ever since then, I've kind of been into comics. And yeah. was when I was in third grade and my teacher was Mrs. Wagner and the entire school was going to be having renovations. They had taken the furniture out of the unimportant rooms and the day before we had taken a class vote. That day we decided that Mrs. Wagner would ask the principal if we could have no furniture as well. Leave it if you want to, but we actually bought sleeping bags and we pretended that we were camping all day long and Mrs. Wagner actually bought marshmallows and graham crackers and chocolate and in the microwave that they had, she went down and she put all the stuff in and made s'mores for the entire class that we had at the end of the day. So that was probably one of the most fun things that I have done at Borland through all the years that I've been there. And I just wanted to say thank you to all of my teachers of all, all of the years who have just been there for me and just helped me. And I know what Mrs. Wagner and a few of the teachers might be thinking, don't worry, I will still be bringing blueberry muffins to the school, even when I'm not going to school though. Um, 
I will really miss this school. Um, one of my memories are playing football with my friends. I made some really good friends like Drew, Oren, Tim, Riley, and the teachers that I had were amazing. My favorite Berlin memory was probably going to Plymouth Plantation um, in fifth grade. Uh, I really loved being there with all my friends, seeing all the replicas, eating the meal. It was just really great experience and it's my favorite memory. Each year at graduation, we honor a parent or family for the Fred Stone Award. The Fred Stone Award is an annual award presented to a parent or community member who has dedicated a high level of volunteerism and service to Berlin Elementary. Mr. Fred Stone was a fifth grade teacher, a PE teacher here at Berlin, and was also a bus driver for many years. He retired in 1998 after 36 years of teaching. After retiring, Mr. Stone continued to substitute teach and volunteered to supervise football games during recess. His love of children, sports, and his generosity will not be forgotten. It is for those reasons we annually honor a parent who also shows the dedication that of Mr. Fred Stone. Our recipient this year is a family that has been involved in so many ways at Berlin and has dedicated countless hours to students and teachers. This family has been involved in helping lead our theater program, they volunteered in classrooms, they've purchased supplies for classrooms, they've coached our athletic teams, they've participated and helped in events like our chili cook-off and PTNA's Holiday Bazaar. These are just a few examples of their commitment. In addition, you'll always be greeted with a smile and with kindness when you are around this family. We will always remember what you have done for the students of Berlin. This year's Fred Stone Award goes to the Nikel family. Congratulations and thank you so much. At this time, we will be awarding our diplomas. Catherine Hebert. Leanna Bell. Talia Boardman Jamin Brunel Booth Riley Jordan Cato Victoria Chan Kevin Farrell Isaac Fleabot Drew Frostick Dominic Garo Kanan Haynes Jeremy Hansen Phineas Hilferty Alexander Ivy Taden Lawless Ethan Marshall Logan Massey Cadence McAllister Sophia McCaffrey Madison McDowell Ashley Nichol Joshua Pearson Lucas Richer Addison Sayers Timothy Spencer
Jaden Sanamore, Jake Stafford, John Stafford, Olivia Stridesberg, Ethan Taylor, Aiden Vilbrin, Oren Winters. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the class of 2020. We wish you all the very best, bright futures, and successful endeavors. Congratulations to you all.